As the smoke clears, blackened corpses stand their own headstones. An innumerable army born of some cauldron, the staring sockets where eyes and limbs once rested, now macabre perches for only the most exhausted of migrators, who rest but a moment on the charred shafts before the scent of all that ashy marrow and the wind only drives them on. The earth too is scorched, unremitting black testament to the raging fury that bent all its breath and power to consume these mountains and these meadows. But there is a glee unmistakable in these wrecked and wretched silhouettes, a triumph in these sooty faces. Life lies still fixed in the roots that churn beneath the charcoal loam, a resurrection that waits only on spring and her certain rains. Fire is a pretender, a masquerade of devastation, but at the last she bends her energies to create, to pound out with vicious fists and cruel hammers a form the stone knew not to dream.